Mark, Brandon, you guys combined for 42 points. This team is so, so deep in the guards. You've got Welch and Quinterly still out, too. You know, what are, what's the potential for the guards on this team, and, and how does that help you guys moving forward? I say we play we play really well off each other. You know, uh, it's really uh, – when you're playing with guys like uh, Brandon, uh, Namari, and JB, it's, it just makes the game so much easier for you. Um, just going back to what he said, you know, we got great guys around us to just give great energy, you know. Even the bench guys give energy to the guys on the court to get us a win. You came out and knocked down a three right away, and you guys made, I think, 10 for the game. How did that feel, that, that three-point shooting? Um, I feel like we got going pretty early and just, you know, maintained the energy that we had coming from each other. Like I said, we just build each other up to win. Coach O's called a timeout early in the game after, you know, Liberty made that easy layup. Just what was his message during the timeout, and then how did things change after that? Just basically said we got to play harder, <laughs> and just he put some fire into us, and now that really set the tone throughout the game. Mark, you were kind of sorry. Mark, you were kind of the spark to uh, kind of ignite the offense in the second half. Like, what was your mindset coming out? Just being aggressive as you were. Uh, just uh, being aggressive and also being unselfish. You know, uh, once I draw, getting paint. Uh, if I have draw two, just make the simple play and kick it out for the wide open teammates. Mark, you kind of had like a shrug after making the three right before the half. It's just kinda, <laughs> you had a nice bounce on a three. Was it just one of those nights where the shots were falling? And then also, how good was that that the shots finally were falling after the last two times on the court? You guys kind of weren't uh, hitting threes. I guess that was—I would say that's a shooter's role. <laughs> it wasn't supposed to go in, but I'm happy it did. But you know, it feels good to see shots go in because we all worked so hard in the summer and also the uh, the fall to see those shots go in. It's just uh, very relieving for all of us. Shooter's touch. Shooter's a few touch. More, <laughs> a few more questions for the I want to ask, ask you both about Amari Burnett and just ha having him pick up uh, Darius McGee full court. I mean, were you guys kind of talking to him the whole time about what he was doing and, and kind of hyping him up throughout the game? Uh, we just really made sure Amari had the you know, energy to guard him full court. I mean, if he got tired, I mean, pretty sure everybody on our team could pick him up full court. I mean, you seen Mark picked him up. I guarded him a few times, and we just – Really just went off with the game plan and succeeded. Yeah, I want to say a uh, sh uh, shout-out to Namari and uh, Jaden Bradley for really just uh, locking him up. Um, I think the, the, throughout the game he had eight points, and he's a really good player, so we really did a good job of locking in on him. You guys had that 17-2 run in the second half, just kind of put them away. What did you see in that in that run, and you kind of wear them down, do you think? I'd say our defense, really. Uh, Coach preached all week that, uh, about defense, 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 and it really showed tonight and it helped our offense. All right, thank you guys. Thank you.